only in Ireland do you stick two nouns together and try to create a, a credible concept that doesn't exist before um, that effort was made. Passage is not an adjective. It's a noun. By its very definition, a passage is not a tomb. That's why it's called a passage. And a corollary is a tomb is not a passage. So here's something that things pass through. It's called a uh, colander. Here's a submarine. You stick things inside. See where the <laughs> okay? This is not a colander submarine. You can stick those two nouns together, but that doesn't work. That's a passage. You can't put two nouns together and say the combined object possesses the attributes of them both. There's no kind of poetic license that will keep this afloat. <laughs> And when you create a culture in which you do join such words together and assume they're real, <laughs> you basically have the Ireland of today in which every single document says passage to passage to tomb, 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 grave, 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 da, 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 da. So Toby, you're talking about striking those terms out of the lexicon. This is a lot of work. It's everywhere, you know? And, and even people, you know, a, a cop ran into me at my club. I told him to go to Ireland. He's like, oh, you've got to go to the tombs. You know, how, how do you begin doing it? But I think it's by raising awareness, as you said. I think the temple of the ancestors has got to be a better better term. But right now, you know, we're, we're living with this oxymoron of, you know, jumbo shrimp or colander passage here. So this is not a colander submarine. This is a very expensive cheese grater. Okay, I'm going to make, make the point that I just don't believe those two words work. So you want me to believe this is a tomb? I see it's a colander submarine pen. I'll just continue adding nouns to it. It's just, it's, it, form follows function. 